Now we have a little smaller crew going in too called um what I know you are familiar with the title. What was written after what time was written for what learning and I will slash it with fill me with a double portion of thy spirit, oh Lord. That is that is that is, that is we merging them things together because when we revise the script here, it is ready for our benefit to grow us more in the spirit. You understand? That means you're clinging close in the spirit. That means the spirit of the Lord is dealing with you on a level. But, um, Lord, as you begin to eat this rule, which, which um, Ezekiel was commanded to, um, what, 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 what the Lord is doing, he will actually fill you with a double portion of his spirit as the times get later I and mean, we actually creep into the very last drop of the um the hourglass then thus says the lord right so what is get, get the basic scripture we're doing this book of romans chapter 15 and verse 4 where it says for whatsoever time was one all right in verse 15 and one it says we then that are strong ought to bear the infirmities of the weak right so that's why we made this videos for you for those brothers who know, you know, you know, starting up and you might be weak in your bones. Now, it's all spiritual. We that are strong with this truth got to bear the infirmities of the weak. That's why we keep making videos to strengthen the weak one that you will become strong. Go ahead. Let's see. Um, so, we of the weak and not to please ourselves. And we're not doing this for self glorification because the Bible says it's not that, it's not of that any man should boast. But it's about true mercy. Yeah, can, can, can. But the Lord say, um, do I preach the gospel? I have nothing to glory of. Yeah, can, can, beautiful. Can, can. Paul said that to you, say, I have nothing to gain when I preach it. In fact, he, he, Paul called himself an unprofitable servant. Mm -hmm. You understand? Well, uh, it say, let every one of us please his neighbor for his good, for, for his good to edification. Now, what does neighbor represent? Your neighbor represents your brother. You understand? That is your brother. Another word for neighbor, his brother, and so forth. Where it says, for every, for even our shy please not himself, but as it was written, the reproach, the reproach of them that reproach the fellow me. Right, so you know what the Bible says? When you're going to Isaiah, oh Lord, I don't want, I want to misquote scripture. But anyway, when you go to the book of Isaiah, you brothers know what I'm talking about. He said the chastisement of our peace was upon him. Read, read that over again. Read that over again. Right, let's say, for even in our shy please not himself, but as it is written, the reproaches of them that reproach thee fell on me. Right, so the scripture says, the chastisement of our peace was upon him. And by the stripe, by his stripes that he received, we were healed. We were healed what? Spiritually. Mm. And physically too, but we didn't know the spirit, so we were healed spiritually. Well, uh, it says, for whatsoever things were written at four times. So, what, what, so when we look back in the scripture and we see those things were written way back there, well, were written for our learning. Was written for what? For our learning. For our learning. You know, me and my brothers and I were just having a discussion of, 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 on a certain topic. You know, I don't want to get into it. That's just personally between us there. And, you know, through the scriptures we've seen what, hey, but how I came with it, you know, that's a very same topic we didn't know what was written half the time is written for our learning. That's how beautiful the spirit is that we could pull them spirit back in the ancient time and, and see it manifesting in our time. Can you go ahead and the scripture and say, um, um, for, we bear with you that the spirit, the spirit bear with you that our spirit that we are the children of God. Yeah, we're the same prophets who was prophesying way back then. We hear again. You want to add anything to it, Sarge? Yeah, because, um, you know, simple like way of the point of the fought like with King, with King, King David, when he did, um, you know, um, commit that, that, that act with um, Israel, with when, when he looked into death right. and he went with his wife, you know, that, that, that simply say, well, you know, for a brother not to commit adultery or go with a man wife. Right. So we, we, we learn that, we learn that, we learn the way, you know, oh, oh, in a sense that the Lord set in a way that you know, we ought to know how to walk because yeah. we get examples, you know, we get, you know, poor, 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 poor examples for, 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 for us not to walk in a way that said that, all right. Nearly, nearly everything he said, it was, it was like, you know, it was breaking at the covenant. 
Yes. Because when they read the Bible, as we leave, they tell them, yeah, the majority is Israel went off. Because Moses actually talked about it, say, when I, even when I die, you know, they, they're going to go off, uh, even, even in the latter days. So everything when they do, they they, they, they go in against the how of our But you don't say you wake up a royal person, a chosen generation. So we ought to understand, you know, from the mistakes are, are the prophets or the mistakes, you know, are, are the Israelites, you know, which is the Hebrews, which we know, which we know, you know, even I lot same way, you know, and, and not to not to walk in that direction, not to to, to sin or add sin upon sin. Uh, you know, so yeah, what I, you know that would not to burn to learn. Can you right? Learn from, 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 from other mistake. Learn from other mistake. Not even not even mistake. Sometimes sometimes you learn from the prophets them in the past because one mistake you learn make everything happen. Can, that can. we would learn we can learn from it in the past. Yeah. That's why we gotta stay in, in the spirit. Hey, did 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 how shall I learn from, 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 from when he was Solomon? He sure did. Because the Lord said when he, when he go off he will what? He will chast when Solomon said he would what? He would chastise him with the rod of men. But when did that happen? Did that happen any time when Solomon was king? Nobody mm -hmm. couldn't really be the king. But it happened when Yahawashai came. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And, and then the scripture oh. say, he learned by the things he suffered. Mm -hmm. That is the scripture. He mm -hmm. learned by the things he suffered. So when you don't turn on the pressure on you, it's not to, to cast you out, but it's for you to learn through the things you're suffering mm -hmm. to bring you to what? To perfection. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You have a scripture? Yeah. Bring it up. Bring it up. It is about um, Second Timothy chapter, chapter, chapter three and verse sixteen. It's all scripture is given by inspiration. Wow! Yeah, wow! Woo! We don't know how to do Second Timothy chapter three and verse sixteen. It's all scripture is given by inspiration of the Hawa. Break it up for them, yeah. Yeah, all scripture, is, all the scripture, the whole, everything in the word, in the word, like how they say. Paul made a mistake here, or this one made a mistake that, that they offer that because yeah, all scripture was inspired. Every scripture was inspired by Yahweh. Well, yeah, see, and it's profitable for doctrine. Huh? Well, for reproof, for correction. For what? For reproof, for correction. Hey, if you huh? open, like I said in some videos prior, if you open the Bible, if you open the Bible and the Lord is correcting you, that means Lord sitting and dealing with you. Mm -hmm. Because every day, brother, God open the scripture. Look, brother, I'm around here. He could be with this. Like every day, um, I open this Bible to read or do a video. It's something the Lord correcting the spirit one. Huh? So most of the time when you hear brother, God say certain thing, and I might say, wait, that is ready for me. It's ready for me. <laughs> and even um brothers say you know, so if you come you know in Great Millstone, I show all brothers, you know, um, you know, this happened to them, like you know they wanted that answer. Um, and I've do a video on it or mm -hmm. something going on with them through the spirit. And I've do it like a time I was studying, like in one spirit was jumping me, pertaining to you know, giving arms. And same I was studying about you know, giving arms at the same time as my phone, my phone pop up is a, is a, is a video talking about arms. Yeah. So it's like, yeah, how about she and shy? Yeah, I give some arms, you know, and that is the spirit that you have a shame and shy and the the law. But even the body are doing that we, we, we are all one body in the Amashia. Yeah. So it, it, it is true. The, the, the Lord has, has give us our, our answers. The Lord has correct us, reproof us. You know, he might put in a brother video or he might bring a brother bring it here face to face, you know, and correct you. So um go, go back there, go back there. Yes, it's for reproof, for correction, for instruction in righteousness. Cancel in righteousness, you know, for correction, you know, for instructions. So why when I brother do videos, you know, when I brother do videos and I brother come and correct you know, to instruct you to, to be righteous, to walk in righteousness, you know? So that will be perfecting ourselves by, by by being corrected. So when we when we when I, back to what I was saying, we, we see that you know, in, 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 in the scriptures, somebody prefers to burn. And we now had to learn through their burn, you know, to perfect ourselves in this time and to know how to work. Can't how to, to, to the way upon the whole armor at the Amashia. See what you say? You know? <laughs> you can laugh with that. You can laugh with it. That, that, that whole genitals because the Lord come, the Lord, the Lord come, you know, in a manner how a man ought to live, how, how a man ought to be, you know? Humble, meek, humility, 
you know, as um, 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 the apostles are like, yeah, here, was talking about the humility, you know, and that our brothers ought to be. I even was talking about it in one more video to exalt yourself higher than our brother in the shoe. Because then I did a how much you know, even to the smallest one. Right. Yeah, I remember, I, 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 like, I remember, I, I think they had a statement, I remember watching that time, I was watching a, 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 a Chinese picture, with a Kung Fu movie. But you know, you can even tell you kind of thing in the spiritual. Um, when he said, um, when I think it was with Jet Li, he came into the Shaolin Temple and he met he, um, well, he met Ibrahim Jenai and he, 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 the master telling him, he said, listen, remember, don't try to exalt yourself if you learn anything because we are all students here. <laughs> you understand what I say? Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Go ahead. So, yeah, you continue in verse 17, it says that the man of Ehawa may be perfect. Read it over again, actually. Let me get it. Okay, this is Yapa. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In um, book of Second Timothy chapter three and verse sixteen, yeah. it's the all scripture is given by inspiration of the Hawaiian. Well, and it's profitable for doctrine. Yeah, so it's profitable for doctrine for for well, for reproof. For what? Reproof. Eh? The Lord will reproof you. That is that is the key to this knowledge. The key to this knowledge is taking reproof. And he that take reproof with what? The scripture says wise. Ah, well, yeah. The man that wanted away from, from reproof just profit paraphrase the world. In fact, the scripture says the man that wanted away from his shall remain in the condition of his dead, right? So like you have any way you better can put it up on the thing, but well correction. Oh, oh, wander away from the way of understanding shall remain in the con condition of the dead. So if you don't understand that this, the Lord, the Spirit of the Lord is here to reproof you, that you may go in righteousness, and then you will remain in the congregation of the dead. Where that? It's in for reproof, for correction. For reproof, for what? Correction. Where? For instruction. For in what? For instruction in righteousness. For instruction in righteousness. Mm. So what is commandment? Commandments go back into the word instruction. Yeah. You must obey the instructions of the Lord. Mm -hmm. Yeah, right, it's on that? Yeah, yeah, go ahead, verse 17. Beautiful. Yeah, Paul. That the man of Yahweh may be perfect. Now, who is the man of Yahweh? The prophet. If you call yourself a prophet or a teacher or a preacher, that the man of Yahweh, well, may be perfect, truly furnished unto all good works. That the man of Yahweh may be perfect, truly furnished unto what? Unto all good works. You understand? Yahweh, that was the scripture in Timothy that said, um, 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 what? Um, when we when break it down the scripture, you see, I am not ashamed of the gospel. No, no, it, 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 it's not that scripture I'm looking for. The scripture we say that um, um, who, um, rightfully dividing the word of truth. You you can get that scripture, but rightfully that is in Timothy 7. No, it's in the word of truth. Bring it, bring it out right there. Rightfully dividing the word of truth. You understand? Yeah, just bring it out. Because sometimes, you know, but I got not, not all this hundred and thing, but I know what I'm saying. You understand? Yeah, it is it, 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 Yapa. You understand? And then and then and then when then, then by you rightfully dividing with a truth that means that the Lord is baptizing you with what? A double portion of the spirit. You understand? When we read Proverbs um twenty seven man seventeen first name. Yeah, let me try to look here for you again. Proverbs twenty seven man seventeen. All praise is Abashim or Shai Bashim was that for that. Proverbs 27 and 17. Gun. Uh, there it is. He said, Iron sharpened iron. So, when, like Brother Howard was saying, when you watch a brother and then, you know, a brother pop up video and then in your spirit get reproved by it, that that means you had a little blunt on your sword. <laughs> and you know what the Lord had to do? Yeah, the Lord had to do. Yeah, a little rust started to go get there. Yeah. So, you know what you had to do? You had to sharp man a little rust. Yeah. That means you had to be sharp all the time. So verse 27, he said, I am, um, sorry, Provoke 27 and 17, he said, I am sharpened, I am, so a man sharpened the countenance of his friend. Mm -hmm. Yapa. Yeah. He said, I am sharpened, I am, so a man sharpened the countenance of his friend. Like while we taking brother's video, brother's taking every video, and so we sharpening one another with the word. And it was, it was like, you know, because we, we all, you know, we all talk about the two heads, so, you know, and when you all tell him, you know, make, we can be in our, in our, in our, in our path. Right. You know, it, it, you know, it, 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 in a sense that you know, we we is like you know, knowledge upon knowledge, wisdom upon knowledge, uh, upon wisdom, understanding upon with understanding. Right. So within you have another tree, knowledge, wisdom, and understanding, 
and if you don't have man with knowledge with them understanding, you ought to get connection, you ought to be on fire, you ought to be focused because you understand what the brother is saying. You know, you understand exactly what he's saying. You you you, you being in this point as the brother being in this point because we are all one body in the Amashia. Where did the brother Yeah. Yeah, what we said to Oh, we don't know. It's a good thing. Yeah, it's a good thing. What did Lord say? Study to show yourself approval to your house. That is the scripture. Study. We're going to be in the scripture all time. Bang in the scripture out. Study to show thyself approved at all times. Well, and to your power, a workman that needed not to be ashamed. A workman that needed not to be ashamed. So I'm not going to deal with a subject unless I'm sure about it. And if I'm not sure about it, I'm not going to bring it out to mislead any man. When the scripture says sons and daughters of, of, of the Lord are led by the Spirit. Well, sons of God. Remember that? Yeah. Remember that? Yeah. In context. Because yeah. the Lord dealing with men. So sons of God are led by the sons yeah. of God are led by what? The Spirit of the Lord. Lord. Yeah. And they that are led by the Spirit of God are the sons of God. So if you're not if, if you bring out something and it, it goes off, it's because it wasn't meant by the Spirit of the Lord to it right, be so. Right, right. Um, I want to say that um, back up. We were talking about showing us a proof. And how we go show us a proof, you know, it say in Revelation 10 and 9, they say, and I went unto the angel and he said unto me. Give me the little book. And he said, I tell you what? Give me the little book. Right. You see, it, 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 this is this, going back into Ezekiel 3. So we wear that. Okay. Right. It say, and he said unto me, take it and eat it up. What did Lord say to do? Take it and eat it up. What do you mean by take it and eat it up? Study. study. Night and day. Night and day study. Okay. Where? It say, and it shall make thy belly bitter. And it shall make thy what? It shall make thy belly bitter. It will make your belly bitter. Your belly, your bowels is another representation of your spiritual. Okay. Because you, you see, it, 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 the bitterness is, is understanding that the, 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 the things you have to go through for this truth. You understand? And the endurance and the hardship the Lord is going to put and it's going to make your belly bitter. Go ahead. And it shall make thy belly bitter, but in, in it shall make... It shall be in thy mouth sweet as honey. Why is it going to be in your mouth sweet as honey? Because now you know, to, to prophesy and to let people know about the goodness of the Lord is as sweet as honey. Um, you understand? Know, which represent the kingdom of heaven, by the way. Go ahead. Um, it says, And I took the little book out of the angel's hand uh, and ate it up. He said, I took the little book, which is the Bible. My, it wasn't actually this book. It was in a scroll form. Where, and it was in my mouth sweet as honey and it was in my mouth what sweet as honey where and as soon as it had eaten not all this is just a metaphor we of we the men of the lord studied it night and day you know going on in this piece and breaking it down done. but john yeah, um representing the men of the lord he said and i took the little book and what say and as soon as i had eaten it right my as, belly was better yeah and as soon as he began, he began to study it and understand it he said his belly was better done and so like yeah, and I really go into us in this time when we thinking that you know we have a hidden friend and you thinking that you know um your 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 hidden friend you know um he was real you know good at and 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 and, and you know the Lord deal with you and he will really can't have have fun and you know thinking that you know these pigs gonna you know it will be the kingdom of heaven with you when you really find out that these is Edens this put them for you in slavery. <laughs> you know, they, 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 especially you saw Edom. Yeah, they think they had to go through for yeah. this and your, and your family, you know, they, 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 oh, yeah. They, yeah, your oh, yeah. family is the ones who would be cursing you and I want to put you up to, to get something. To, to, oh, yeah. To, 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 to get yeah, and, 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 and these are the ones you go up with as a youth, knowing yeah. that, that, that you are to curse them out at the end. Can. Knowing that they ain't right with the Lord. Because you are what say, who is my brother, my brother and sister, and everybody is good and they're doing what and in fact, yeah, I was shy. said this out of your mouth. He said, He that loveth more than father, more than sister, more than me is not worthy of me and cannot be my disciple. Yeah. You understand? Meaning to say that you don't check the deeds they're doing, you rebuke them and reprove them. You understand? Or you, you just stay away from the Jordan line with them. Because it's wisdom. <laughs> so it's well, uh, there was, there was, there was every evil that is something good for you. Remember, he was 
you don't say you do, you are, you say surely Yahweh will do nothing but reveal the secrets and things that the prophet. Go down, we'll go to the next verse. Right? It says, um, the, the, the lion had roared. No, who is the lion? The lion is Yahweh Shai Mashiach. The lion roared, which means the word of he out of his mouth came the word of God. Well, who will not fear? Who will not fear? Who, 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 who will not fear? Can well, we as the men of the Lord, we fear. That's why we ate, when we ate, when, when, when the, that scripture said that, that he that read it may run. Man. When they read it, men yeah. just say, you one prophesy. Yeah, because yeah, it's like, you know, the reason why he got run because he was instructed. And it, the, because God said in, in um, Proverbs 1 and, 1 and 7, he said, the fear of Yahweh is the beginning of, of, of knowledge. Yapa. But fools. You know, um, he was um, um, yeah, well, instructions. Yeah, so they, the men of God, will get instructed and will take heed and will do their what they was instructed to do. Go out and run with it, go and prophesy, you know, go and do the works. Really talk about that little part there. Yeah, it's say, um, it say, the lion had a rod who will not be, who, who will, will not, not fear, afraid, who will not fear, so that yeah. well, and Yahweh, Paul had spoken. Who can, who can, but prophesy? So the only thing we could do in this time is prophesy. Can, can, can. And prophesy, the scripture said, one, give them warning from me, whether they hear or for beer. So if they fall up there, then the scripture said, dust their foot and condemn this place. Can, and you know, come to me in spirit, go back into the, the sicker, I don't know, go back into the gun rage. I remember that you have a video of being humble in the shoot. You know, because when we, we go back to your home, when Peter had a joy sword, right. you know, and put back his sword in, in, in his, um, in his, what is it wood? Um, shit. Shit, <laughs> yeah, the can. He put back his sword in his shit. So, you telling me you go down, it come like, all right, Peter, I'm going to be Peter, have a gun in your hand, right? And shoot out her ears. And you don't say, hey, put back that gun in, in the socket. And, uh, you know? Yeah, because you have come to Matthew, you give more clarification. Yeah, yeah. When you do that now, you know you do? You add can and let it to the scriptures. Can. And the scriptures, you, know, you want to give a call for every idle word and every canal thing you do, you know. The Lord's angel, the Lord is recording everything. The Lord says, if you add to this, you add the plagues to you. Yeah. And if you take away anything from this, you take away anything from the book of life. Yeah. Because you trusted in his he so blessing. He saw blessing was here. He was blessed with that sword. You blessed with this sword. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Which is the word. I don't bring a piece of tobacco here. I have a piece of Revelation chapter 22 verse 18 It says, For I testify unto every man that heard the word of the prophecy of this book It says, If any man shall add unto this, these things, Yahweh shall add unto him the plagues that are written in this book <laughs> So you know, so when I was saying your point you know, Yahweh Hashem is going to add the plagues that are written on this book to these brothers so when they feel like you know, they, they live in my way. You all say, who live by the sword shall die by the sword. Right, if right. they want to live by the sword, the Lord will give them. All right, you want to live by the sword? All right. Jacob Shovel, he's still coming for yeah. him. The sword is <laughs> coming for him. Yeah, you hear what Brother Howard said? What is the sword? P P Peter came, that spirit came upon Peter, and Peter chopped the Roman soldier's ears off. And what they have a child, he said, you know, that's not how he's going to function, you know. He that lived by that sword will die by that sword. <laughs> you understand? So the Lord said, hey, that's not going on. He said, man shall not live by bread alone, but by every word that when the Lord rebukes Satan, kind of. by every we word that comes from God. And he tells, um, say, um, get behind me, Satan. Yeah. You know, so, so, so it's like, you know, it, 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 that time was last spirit. Yeah. As, as spirit, because it was the Lord hour. And then I, I then I, how shall I say, hey, you know, um, uh, prophecies are not, are not fulfilled. Then that will be done. Yeah. So you can't come and try to change Prophecy always supposed to be because when you go tell Peter that hey, when he, when, when you can deny me and the couple crow three times, you know, uh, I have you deny me three times and the couple crow, you know, so and that will go on. So you try to tell me this modern day time you feel go against it, um, 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 you saw Edom with the same thing they extended, you know, same thing automatically. You feel it with the air of the AED. You see, you wasn't blessed <laughs> with that. You wasn't. That is not your blessing. You wasn't blessed with that. How you could go, go to that and you, the Lord didn't pronounce that your blessing? And I like this so trying to come up against me with the scriptures. That one is it, it, what we see over there. You can say the inspiration. How come they? It's like he's so trying to take the. You see, what have you to do to take the, the covenant of the Lord in your mouth? In your mouth can, because you can't come up against the men of the Lord with the scriptures. Then it's for this was for Jacob. This is the blessing here. Right, right. The same way we can go up against you. With your good, with God, the same thing because you was blessed with that. Ah, uh, gosh, wait. Well, you got something there? Yeah, but, uh, 
Yeah. You hold on to where you have the arm, the arm, Yara, because you'll come to that just for it. You want to right, be right? Well, I'd say, yeah, we'd say, we, we know what will be our strength and, and our shield in that time. I'd say, in the book of Proverbs chapter 18, verse 10, I say, The Lord, Yahweh of Hashem, your shine is our strong tower, it's what? the righteous run it into it. It's what's going on. It's in the book of um, Proverbs chapter 18, verse 10, it say, Yah, the, the name of Yahweh of Hashem, your shine. Is a strong tower. Is a what? Is a strong tower. Is a what strong tower? Well, it say the righteous run it into it. The righteous there type in the elect. Right. If you if you if you decide to take up a gun and feel that like that will be your strong tower, you're not part of the elect, brother. I'm sorry to say that way, you're not part of the elect. Like and the, then I'm a man right. I watch and I said, Carrie, my mama watch about who you to say is not part of the elect. Okay, I'm not saying and listen, let's get to what I'm saying. It's because they say by the fruit. They shall know them. Can. What you're producing is what your, your, your congregation is feeding from. Can. So the scripture says, by their fruit, you shall know them. Can. So if, if, if you see brother nigga come one day and, and, and having these brothers here with ER, this and that and modeling on that, you don't know you don't know what time it is with brother nigga. Yeah. I don't. Yeah, right. you, you don't have to say much about me, you don't know what time it is with me. You come and add to the word because if you really put it, it'll be like um, um, Glock 17 is a strong tower. You understand? But the are 15 is a strong tower. But the only scripture say it say the name of your how about show your try is a strong tower. That is our strong to tower righteous. to the righteous, the elect. It's Go ahead. It's say run it into it and it's safe. And, and the righteous run into it that is what? It is safe. safe. And it's safe in it. I'm not safe with no gun. If I put you off guns, you don't have to watch your head. No, you don't have to watch your head. No, you don't have to watch your head. Yeah, because I'm because I'm because I'm going to say, I will take you before you take me on. You know, you come in. Exactly. You know, you come in because. So you always have to be watching your back. You always be watching this thing. That is why I scripture. Another scripture said, no weapon from the dead shall shelter. Because we aim the strong tower. Which is your how much life? We don't have. Right, this, this is Second Corinthians 10, and I'll start from verse 3. It says, For though we walk in the flesh, we do not war after the flesh. Wow. It says, For our weapons are not carnal. Oh. For our weapons, it's not, for the weapons of our warfare are yeah. not carnal. So, we, right. so, so when these brothers, I mean, we don't want, we, we not, we not, it's not necessarily that we're bringing them up, but things that come up to the spirit. Yeah. So, so when you're modeling with these guns and things, like, like not only them alone, ISUPK, we show them to do that. So, when you are modeling with these things on, 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 on things, you're actually showing the, the whole world that your weapons is what? It's carnal. But our weapons, and this is this is my weapon here. See yeah. this? Now I they even big block here. <laughs> now we're going back. Now we're going back into Slack here. Yeah? Now we're going back into the lesson. You know, war, war written after time is written power learning. But we never see yet up in the scriptures the Lord say to go against the soul with the sword. We never see that. We know that Israel is really so war in the days are old. But in this time here, yeah, was trying to say you know, it's not the time for that. Hey, hey, hey because. Hey, get a scripture for me, wrestling up against flesh and blood. Right, because right. they do the same thing. Same thing. Same here because you always hear, I'm finish it. Yeah. It's here for, for though we walk in the flesh, we do not walk after the flesh, for the weapons of our warfare are not carnal, but mighty through your power to the pulling down of strongholds. So, how is Esau coming down? How is Esau's stronghold? Is, the stronghold represents the system. How is it coming down? Through the spirit and the power of your power by Shema Mashiach Yahushai. Through this word, that, that, that we're about to symbolize um, Jacob pulling out Esau's heel and how we do in growth on the highways and byways and spiritually prophesied as we see in growth on the highways. Last, last Sunday, you know, we prophesied that the Omega, the, uh, the, 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 the Omicron was going to uh, hit Trinidad and hey, the day after, it's the day after, after so hey, hey, we need prophets and even yeah. uh, we need prophets and we prophets and we need prophets and we need The truth is we can only live by God's sake, we can only tell you the truth. Like, I'm, and it's also, I might become your enemy because I can tell you the truth. I'm going to bring on that. So this, this, you know, this, this, this really applies here when it says casting down imaginations and every high thing that exalted itself against the knowledge of Yahweh. You understand? That we apply this thing because anything that comes against, because the first scripture that says, um, the canon mind is enmity against Yahweh. Yeah, the flesh war it against the spirit. Also. So, knowing that anything canon, 
his rival, when he went to do with them, that his rivalry, you understand, was against. Yeah, you coming up against the Lord. You come up against the Lord. You understand, the Lord done already said, and do his for that. You know, the Lord pulling down the car. No, what, no, what, what did he say to Zerubbabel? He says, not by might, nor by. He said, just says the Lord to Zerubbabel. He says, not by might, nor by any but, power that but, you but, have, right, but right. by my spirit, right. says yeah. the Lord. What is my spirit? The Holy Spirit. Right. Says the Lord. That is how we prophesy in the Holy Spirit. Right. Right. So we stay in the Spirit to, uh, to achieve the things of the Lord. Right. So, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Bring up the piece of the yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, you <laughs> you want to fight Esau on his own ground, he will kill you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know that? This is the first sense of that 18 and verse 2. You see, you see, how is my rock? Yeah, how is my what? Yeah, is my rock and my fortress. Yeah, how is my rock and my fortress? No, 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 Go ahead. And and my deliverer. And my what? And my deliverer. And my he said the Lord is my rock, my fortress, and my deliverer. Go ahead. My power, my strength. My power and my strength. Go ahead. In whom I will trust. In whom I will trust. In whom Israel shall trust. In whom the elect will trust. Man. Go ahead. You continue to say. Yeah, my buckler. My what? My buckler. My buckler. And the horn of my salvation. And to get and to obtain salvation, he is the horn, which is the horn represents power. power. So he's the horn or the power of my salvation. And my high tower. It goes back to what Bible have but I was just reading right there. And my head. That is on that and my high tower. Yeah. yeah. He, he appointed on that. You understand? What we asking the Lord for in this time at Kim is a double portion of the spirit. Go back into the scripture what tell it every now. You understand? This is what we want. And every time we go into this world, we're being baptized with the spirit. Yeah, washed. Washed. <laughs> and being baptized. And uh, the while washing of the water, which is this word. <laughs> then they've been um the power homosexual and, and right. And we said what a wet homosexual. <laughs> You know, or oh, the pop a a a a the old child come up a wet adult child. You see the baptism is like eternal baptism. You all keep thinking about the outward man. That may be carnal. Well, well, yeah. This is the book of Second Kings, chapter two and verse nine. Well, it says it came to pass when they were born over. That that he, now this is Elijah and Elisha. Well, he said, yeah, he said that Elijah said unto Elisha, uh -huh. ask what. I yeah, say, ask what I shall do for thee. Now, what we asking the Lord for, not a portion, a double portion of the spirit, to endure, the, to, to endure this affliction that's about to come upon the whole world. And even Israel, uh, even the elect will have a little squeeze in it when the scripture say, Don't worry, um, Jacob, fear not thy womb, Jacob, I, for I am here to deliver you. We, 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 we will deliver, but in order to endure this thing, You've got to have a very portion of the spirit upon here. Read it over again, huh? Yeah, it says, and it came to pass when they were born that born over us, that, yeah, that Elijah said unto Elisha, yeah. ask me what I shall do for thee. So the Lord is asking the spirit, what, what do you want the Lord to do for you? Well, like, we, we don't want riches, no gain in this kingdom because the Lord said that carnal. If you never start through your carnal. Can't. You understand? But here's what Elisha said to Elijah. Well, before I be taken away from In other words, this is how this is what you're supposed to answer the Lord and, and, and tell him. Well, and, and Elisha said, I pray thee. And Elisha said unto uh, Elijah, Well, I pray thee, let it away portion. Let a what? Let it away portion. This is what we're supposed to be telling the Lord. Lord, let a double portion. Well, of thy spirit. Of thy what? Of thy spirit. Uh -huh. Be upon me. Be upon us, Lord. I believe it's like praying for a double portion. That's not guns and ammunition. What concept is that? That is why you have to be careful who you're listening to out here. 
You know, said, every, every, when you now come to the truth, everything that sounds sweet on YouTube until they start to get deep in the thing and realize that everything is not all that bitter is gold. Oh. He said, let a double portion of thy spirit be upon me. That is what the elect crying for. Son of man prophesy against the prophets of Asia that prophesy and say, So here we say that he, he, he can say, Son of man prophesy against the prophet, yes. not against his son all this time. They're so going against the prophet of Israel who prophesy and say, Thou, um, thou unto them that prophesy, that prophesy out of their own hearts, that prophesy out of their own hearts, meaning mind. the imagination of your mind. Yeah. Because with all the that is why we, that is why the elect will ask for a double portion of the spirit because we yeah. don't prophesy out of the own mind. We prophesying and praying in the Holy Spirit in the yeah. yeah. that. That is why GMF, you say Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahusha, Bahasham, Raka Kodash. Now you understand it. Now you understand what we just say, Raka Kodash. Let's see. Hear ye the word of Yahweh. Thus says Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahusha. Let's see. Woe unto the false prophets. But woe unto the what? The false prophets. Because we prophesy in the Holy Spirit. You prophesy in the imagination of your mind. That's where you're going carnal before the Lord. And Go ahead. They say that follow their own spirit. That follow their what? Their own spirit. Yeah, the scripture says in Jeremiah 30, they take a covering but not of my spirit. <laughs> Where? It say, uh, and have seen nothing. And they have seen what? Nothing. They see, they see nothing. When you come to Great Millstone, you know it's only visions and prophecy you get them. <laughs> because we praying and, and, and prophesying in the Holy Spirit. Damn. If you can't understand that when hey, the Lord is dealing you with you, I'm sorry to tell you that, but that's how it is. That's right. That's you may right. song like, you may song like, you may song like, you're going good, but when you're weighing down, the Bible says you break down to nothing, you just hot air. Mm. Mm. Right, all is in East Wind. Yeah, Mark 13 and 29. It says, But he that shall blaspheme against the Holy Spirit had, had never forgiveness, but is in danger of eternal damnation. You understand? So, they that blaspheme against. The true breakdown that the, our, our, the apostles are bringing on the true gospel, they in danger. You must, be, you, you must be in danger in it because when you hear why you're in danger, because when you, we, we know if you say what you're saying is correct, when we look at your liberty and what you're defending, it is not of the Lord. The Lord has nothing to do with that. So we know you're off bad. Sorry to tell you, but you're off bad. And they talk about the microchip is that, I'm sorry, the, not the microchip, the mark of the beast is that embargo. <laughs> Who are man or John 3 16? Mm. You understand? Know, you understand? Know, some, 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 take to, uh, this brother from um, Watchman of Israel because you know, I still love that brother, um, brother, um, this guy, the, 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 the leader for the Watchman of Israel, he called him, but um, Nakwam. Why, 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 why I love that brother for because you know, I believe, I believe really and truly he's a man of the Lord, but he, all he needs to do is to be open minded. Don't come up against James. Be open minded to the prophecy. Yeah, humble humble yourself. Humble yourself. Yeah. Because, you, you, because you're a very talented brother with the scripture, but you just need to be humble. Yeah. That is all you need to do. Yeah. Humble and, and, and walk in the way of the Lord. Because remember, at the end of the day, at the end of the day, it, this, this walk is with you and the Lord now, you know. Yeah. You, know you have to walk with the Lord. And the Lord begins to open things to you. You can study what that one say or what that one say. You understand what the Lord is showing you. Yeah. You understand? You see the MOTV to be the, the, the RFID chip. Preach it. And Preach it without fear. And go hard on it. You understand what I say? Go hard with it. And the Lord will make you a flame of fire. That's right. Yeah. Because you, ha you are very talented, brother. I'm telling you, but it's just hey, pride. Yeah, pride. Yeah. Pride will cut down a man to nothing if you make pride. If, 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 it, if it make it come true, yeah, take over. Yeah, yeah, pride. Because hey, in, in this flesh, as we know, when you go through this purpose, as you're talking in the, in the same way, you know, where, um, I forgot 
pagpunta ng Paolo yun eh. We know that the Lord po like simply the Spreadway Ponsol. You know, that Spreadway Ponsol, that, 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 that's why uh, 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 things we can live with and uh, play the string instrument to, to cast out the Spirit. So we did everything as we did video um, last Sunday. Everything is vanity and vexation and spirit. No. So by you, you try to feel like you, you, you know, you in the heart on top, brother. Or but when you when you say Corinthians twelve and twelve, first Corinthians twelve and twelve. All our we, the, 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 all our we is part of the body, body of it, but many many members. But all our we is one in the amashia, you know. So 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 hey, we know it's not like you coming up again soon or whatever. We ought we ought to tell you to do the correct thing. So you come like we don't uh, uh, come out and, and, and reach out to you to instruct you to do the correct yeah, thing. Yeah, scripture says provoke him brother. In love, yeah. that is what you call righteous provocation. That, okay. You provoke him in love. Yeah. You understand what I'm talking about? So that is what the man of Great Millstone was ordered by the Lord to do. Keep provoking. Every time he pop video, it's provoking. Righteous provocation. Right. Provoking your mind. Right. You understand? The thing you know, hey, you know what? Yes, boy. Yes, boy. The, 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 the can't because the, 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 as the time drawing closer and it closing in like this right now, you don't want to be saying the same thing and going off. Then, if, when that time closes in and your house is making it return, you cannot tell the Lord, well, Lord, I never know that the, the, the RFID chip was in my idea, maybe lost it, but you heard it. Yeah. You can't, heard can't, it. Can't, can't. So now, we are great men, so our hands is washed from your blood. Our hands is washed from not just and not just dealing with just one particular brother. Any brother out there who listening that is not part of great, great millstone that is preaching false doctrine and you know deep within yourself your doctrine falls. And we was warning you when the time closes you know, and there is no more to say, our hands is being washed from your blood. Oh, mm. So hey, 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 hey. You know, you know. Oh, give me, give me, give me, um, Baruch 5, you will end that scripture. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Baruch chapter 5. That's like one of my favorite scriptures. <laughs> yeah, okay, so that's what we start. Baruch chapter 5, and then you end it with that. Yeah. Look at Baruch chapter 5, and this one bread is to put off the Jerusalem. Yeah, yeah. In Luke chapter 5 and verse 1, it says, yeah. put off O Jerusalem the garment of mourning. The garment of what? Mourning. Because we're getting ready right now, we're getting ready to put on the garment of mourning. Right. Well, Where? An affliction uh -huh. and put on the comeliness of the glory that cometh from Yahweh forever. Right, which means we, we, we're getting ready to receive the kingdom of heaven. That's mm -hmm. why I made a video. By faith, receive your inheritance. Right. Everything we operate by Great Millstone to begin with is a faith based um, camp, right? Mm -hmm. in every brother all over the world in Great Millstone is big. Our, 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 um, in our, our life is based on faith. Yeah. Where? You see, cast about the double garment. No, that double garment is what we read with what Elisha yeah. asked Elijah for with a double portion yeah. of the Holy yeah. Spirit. Yeah. Like what the elect is crying out for. Yeah. Where? Yeah. God is a class about the double garment of the righteousness which cometh from your heart. Which is the Holy Spirit. Because the scripture says when the spirit of truth is coming, it will lead you into what? All, All truth. truth. Mm -hmm. Not some truth, not 50% truth, not 25% truth. All, All truth. truth. So All truth to be thrown at 100%, not all men. Hold on, Jesus. Well. And set a diadem upon his head. Mm -hmm. What is that diadem? Is another type of the Holy Spirit too. A diadem upon the head. Where? Well. Of the glory of the everlasting. Yeah. Of the glory of the what? The everlasting. Go ahead, verse 3. For your heart will show, will show thy brightness yeah. unto every country on the heaven. Meaning that the brothers from all over the world, yeah. from that, that they see right here, you know, what is this gospel, this 100% gospel, in every country there, the Lord showing his right. The Lord showing yeah. his right. Yeah. Whatever says showing, this is a wiser understanding of people. Yeah, that is it from that, that. Yeah, that yeah, is from that. that. Deuteronomy 4 and, and, yeah. Yeah. and 6. So yeah. with that, we hope that this video was edifying to you. We give all praises to your power. Basham, Basham, Kakwadash. And we say double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Mills too that rule well. Trust the bishops that rule well. Um,